In a public comment on Thursday, PNP leader Mark Golden says the government's announcement of gigantic increase in salary for local politicians will create more upheaval. You're listening to Jamaica News Online TV. Kindly make sure you subscribe, like, share, and guys, comment. Stay tuned. salaries of elected officials should be suspended until the outstanding grievances affecting public sector workers are satisfactorily addressed. I did not come into politics to enrich myself, but to serve the people of Jamaica. As leader of the opposition, I must lead by example at a time like this. I will therefore redirect the bulk of the 240 plus percent increase in my pay and retain 20 percent of that increase and contribute the rest to persons in need and other worthy causes. I intend to do this until the outstanding grouses affecting the public sector workers arising out of the restructuring have been satisfactorily addressed. I am mindful that the leader of the opposition is the only parliamentarian on our side whose package is in the senior executive leadership category. And our other parliamentarians continue to have discussions among themselves as to how best to deal with their situation. The opposition leader was quite missing for some days after the salary increase was announced with the parliamentarians but his excuse is that he took a few days off at the time when it was announced because he wasn't in kingston and his sister was visiting in a public comment on thursday pnp mark golden says the government announcement of the gigantic increase in salary for local politicians will create more upheaval in the jamaican society and it is creating upheaval because this is all people are talking about this massive increase has left people in a state of shock with mouths open eyes open they just cannot understand how can you don't want to give the people who are making such small income a 15 percent increase but yet the, you, the government feel that they can take 150, 200, 250, up to 300 percent increase when nowhere else, nowhere in the Caribbean or anywhere else, nowhere at all, not even in large countries, in first world countries, you hear somebody take 300 percent increase at one time golden called on the comrades to vote out the present jlp government whenever the next general election are called and he says we cannot stand another four to five years of this kind of government that we have now he said there's nobody governing the country now and yet still to justify it wholeness says that when they get the big increase they will perform better because they have not been performing they have not been performing so now that they get the pay so what about the police and the nurses and all those people so he's trying to tell them you don't have to perform because you're not getting the salary to compensate the type of work you're doing Mr. Holness, this is no example to set for people as a leader in the country because you have to lead by example. And the, the opposition leader says, we know what is happening with the public sector salary and what the government has done now to create even more evil in the society by awarding the political class a massive increase while the teachers rank and file police and firemen have not got 
proper settlement. He called on the government for the income tax threshold to be now raised beyond the present 1.5 million limit. So, and he promised in his press conference to only take 20% and donate 70% and the Jamaican people is going to hold him accountable to it. So, guys, thank you for watching. Please make sure you subscribe. Continue watching the video until the end. See you on my next video.